Now, your WLKY weather with meteorologist Daniel Johnson. All right, here's another live view of our brand new downtown tower camera. This one zoomed in on the Ohio River. You can see the Big Four Bridge there in the distance, the pedestrian bridge. A gorgeous shot there. We got some boats on the Ohio as well. And the sky, well, a mix of clouds and sun. Temperatures back up to 90. We hit 90 earlier, then we went down to 89. Now we're back up to 90 degrees. The humidity, though, not bad, 38%. So we will take that in early September. 90 was the official high today. The average high is 86, so it was above average, and it's going to stay above average for the next couple of days, and then a big change arrives. It's also going to be dry as we head into the next couple of days overall. The only chance for rain is late Friday into the late afternoon and evening. Just an isolated pop-up shower or storm. We're not expecting much. And then a fall light preview as we head into the weekend. It's going to turn much, much cooler. So that got me thinking, when does fall begin? Well, we're 18 days away. And then when I thought about the fall countdown, I got me thinking about all the other holidays coming up here. Halloween, 57 days away. Don't forget Election Day, 62 days away. And yeah, I had to put Thanksgiving, 85 days away. All these holidays are just racing up on us and just coming up on us pretty quickly here. Uh, temperatures outside in the upper 80s to near 90, a warm one for sure. We've been battling some clouds at times today. Most of those clouds are south of Louisville. We're seeing more sunshine as you go off to the north. But all these clouds to our south will begin to slide off to the south and we will begin to clear out. Then all eyes turn toward this cold front Looks to be moving pretty quickly here, pushing through Nebraska. It just pushed out of South Dakota. Some unsettled weather associated with it. Some cloud cover, some rain, and much cooler air behind it. I wanted to show you temperatures around that front. 91 in North Platte, 87 in Omaha, but it's 65 in Casper behind that front. It's 72 in Rapid City behind that front. And that cool air is heading our direction, and we're going to feel it as we head into the weekend. Not tonight, though, and not the next couple of days. Some typical summer-like days ahead. We're near 90 now. Temperatures later on tonight dropping down into the upper 60s. We're going to go with a low of around 69 here in the city. We're thinking outline areas will probably drop into the mid-60s with mostly clear skies, and that's about where we should be for this time of year. That 12-hour forecast for tomorrow calls for a lot of sunshine, upper 60s to start your day. And then by the afternoon, just a couple of clouds possible, but we are going to heat it up by just a couple degrees compared to today. We're going to go with 92 or 93 degrees tomorrow. So here's your two day forecast. So a dry day tomorrow, lots of sunshine, a typical summer day, 93 or 90 on Friday. I know a lot of questions. I think I see Kent over there staring me down. He wants to know what the Friday night football forecast is looking like. Just an isolated shower, not enough to really impact any game. So that is some terrific news. Let's time it out on Futurecast. Mostly clear skies tomorrow. And then as we head into Friday, that front approaches. Clouds increase through the day. Still a good amount of sunshine on Friday. And then here we go. By 2 o'clock in the afternoon, a few showers begin to pop up north and west of the city. And those will try to push in here as we head through the evening on Friday. So if you're heading out to any outdoor activities, any games, I would take an umbrella just in case. But really, we're not expecting much, and they're going to be quick movers as well. And then behind that system, a fall-like preview over the weekend, 70s for daytime highs with sunshine, 40s and 50s for lows. It's going to be a bit chilly Sunday morning and Monday morning. And lots of sunshine heading into next week and a slow warm up. Yeah. So it's that time of year we're going to start to get these fall previews, then it warms up again, mm -hmm. but eventually the cooler air will yeah. win out. All right. Yeah. Thank you, Daniel.